Hi, Earth signs, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn, Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising, and those of you cross watching, welcome to your Tarot Love Messages. In today's reading, we're going to take a look and see what should your next be, sorry, what should your next move be with regards to your current situation and circumstances. It is going to be a general reading, so please just keep that in mind. If you're after a personal tarot reading with myself, please feel free to reach out and inquire. I will list my email address below the video. Bit of a heavy energy here guys what's going on no wonder you're having a hard time deciding what your next move should be it's not easy i'm sure some of you have heard the saying you know the devil comes for you at your at your highest moment, right? That's when the devil comes for you. Um, there is someone here around you. I'm going to begin by saying there is someone here around you, a connecting energy. This is someone older, wiser, more mature, perhaps even more experienced than yourself. This is someone who is giving you some very valuable advice. Okay, it feels like you... In your current situation would definitely benefit from listening okay you don't have to take on their advice but at least hear them out because this is someone who has your best interest your best intention at heart and this is someone who maybe they've been there done that or they've lived I don't know it feels like this person is an old an old soul okay um, they might not even be older than you. They might even be younger than you. But there's just such a wise um, energy to them, to this person, that it feels like they've lived a lot of, like they've lived a thousand lifetimes before. You know, they've been through a lot. They've seen a lot. They've loved. They've lost. And this person knows what they're talking about. So again, you know, you don't have to listen. I mean, you don't have to follow the advice. Although a lot of you will benefit from it, but. It does feel like at least hear them out, hear what they have to say, because it does. It's making a lot of sense. It is. It makes a lot of sense. You are going through. You're going through some things. Okay. You're going through the. You're in the midst of a storm. You're in the midst of chaos. You're. A lot of things are feeling very uncomfortable. They might even be feeling very, you know, uneasy, very unnerving here. Just um. Discom a lot of discomfort, a lot of pain. You might not even, you know, they're very turbulent, very tumultuous. There's a lot of things, there's a lot of chaos in the energies here. You're going through, things are changing for you, okay? You're going through a transition, transformation. You'll know, you know how you know this by, by what it is that you've been feeling lately, okay? So you're, you're being, you're being pushed outside of your comfort zone because you are growing you're evolving okay you're saying you're essentially wrapping up certain projects um certain friendships you're moving you know some of you are even like moving you're moving your life you're packing you're going to pack up your life and move to the other side of the world you are going through some very big some very cataclysmic changes and this might still, you know, it might continue on uh, well into the year for a lot of you. There's just, a lot of you are, you know, you're on, you could be ending cycles. And in the process of cycles ending for you, things will feel very uncomfortable, which they have been. They'll feel very heavy. It, it'll feel exhausting. It'll feel draining. It might even feel very, you know, very lonely at this particular point in time. Like, you know, you're doing this on your own. Um... It's important for you, now's a really good time to do some some cluttering, okay, some decluttering here, okay, so there are certain, there are certain things, there are certain people, 
certain situations that aren't serving you that aren't serving you positively that are not serving your greater good and you know they're kind of the, i'm gonna call these things hanger honors hanger honors yeah i don't that's not a word i just kind of made that up but it, these people are kind of just or the situations are just hanging on okay they're hanging on to your energy and they're not doing you any good okay what they are doing you is they're sort of like dead weight they're you know depleting you of your energy depleting you of your emotional mental your physical energy so you need to cut out these people these situations these you know the, the, these very things that it's not healthy for you they're not working for you and look all these friendships whatever they are you know what they are and once upon a time it worked you know once upon a time it was that you know this person was the very person you've always wanted it was the relationship you were happy in it was the job that was fulfilling that was then this is now and now it's just it's not serving you it's not it's no longer working out and truth be told you, you've outgrown okay you've outgrown this person you've outgrown this situation and this is why certain people are taking an exit from your life or this is why the universe is making is putting you in a situation that does feel uncomfortable so that you can move so that you can see someone's true colors and who they really are you can see them for who they really are not for who they want you to see them as you can see that you know this situation that you're in it's not helping you grow it's not helping you evolve it's it's challenging you it's it, it's a you know it's not challenging you rather it's it's uncomfortable for that matter so that and th that's why i feel like what you're in right now this situation the reason why it feels so uncomfortable or it feels so painful is that so you can move that you can move away from it okay moving away from it means removing certain people from your life removing certain um habits maybe or certain toxic to toxic toxic or traits that you have or that someone else has or that the both of you have okay so it's all about you know things and if you're not going to do it and for some of you i feel like you know you, you've kept hanging on or you've allowed these situations of these people to hang on to your energy for far too long and the universe has kind of grew a little bit tiresome of that and because you didn't do it okay you didn't walk away from situations or from relationships that you had grew the universe is stepping in and doing it for you okay because it no longer can watch you do that to yourself and you know the universe is putting you in these situations where truths are being exposed um, things you know towers are collapsing on you not literally but you know figuratively speaking um, things are falling apart relationships are ending friendships connections lies are coming out to the surface okay th that's why you've been put in this situation so ultimately that you know you can see your value you can see what you're worth and you can see how you know you've outgrew someone or something and it doesn't make them a bad person okay some if someone he doesn't you know if they're not going if they if they're not accompanying you on your journey that just simply means you guys are on two very different journeys okay and you know you, maybe you did your part for each other and that's all okay there's no more left in in that person to give to you so it doesn't make it doesn't necessarily have to make anyone a bad guy in this in this scenario and it doesn't make you a bad person either you know if you outgrew someone or you know if you outgrew a situation or if they even outgrew you okay it just means that you know there are certain situations of people or people that you're going to have to leave behind because even if that person or that situation itself is not really toxic per se you staying in a situation or in a connection or in a relationship or a marriage whatever it is for you you staying in something that you can't fit into anymore would mean something very toxic because you're staying in a situation that 
you add growing that you add grew means that you're gonna have to shrink yourself to become however small in order in order to fit that and that doesn't sound too healthy does it all right guys and this is it these are your messages thank you so much for watching and listening please show your support by liking sharing and subscribing to the channel thank you guys so much bye for now